How's it going guys? My name is Carla and welcome to episode 5 of the Mad Pack. So today I thought I would do something a little bit different than what we've done in the past few episodes. So I came up with an agenda so that we could actually stay on track. But at the same time, I'm probably not going to stay on track that much. But either way, uh, the overall goal that I have for today is to actually get some force armor. And then somehow enchant it to make it where I can fly. I looked up a video on YouTube and got a few uh, a few steps here written down just so I can remind myself. So the first thing we're going to need is to make a force rod and then we're also going to need to get obsidian. So uh, we can kind of skip around these things a little bit here but I'll try and explain the mod as good as I possibly can. The whole force armor and uh, the force rod, everything with force in it is basically part of the mod called Darkcraft I believe which I have no clue why they call it that when it's force and everything. But, uh, I also, since last episode, I said I was going to use the topiary grass, or however you say that. Instead, I decided to go with the traditional route, and instead of waiting and trying to get a bunch of seeds to do that, I'm actually, right now, making it spread this far. Now, right before this video, I read a comment, and someone told me that the lucky hoe that I got on the last few episodes, it will let me... I guess silk touch something. I'm not sure if this has silk touch on it, so I want to go check this just real quick, but hopefully it does. Oh yeah, and that sound right there. I finally have the uh I guess the default like alpha slash beta Minecraft. Like look at that cobblestone. That's the good cobblestone. Look at that texture. Oh man. The door sounds. Oh that's just the best stuff. I'm trying to think what else has changed. The uh the dirt running sound has changed. Like that, it, that sounds a little bit weird. The chest sounds are the exact same as the uh, doors themselves. They just sound so good. If you guys have never have tried like the beta stuff, oh, go back there. You'll love it. So, uh, as you can see here, I actually do have the Silk Touch in, uh, enchantment on this. So, I'm not sure how I do this. If I right-click or if I left-click. So, we're going to try it on, say, this one instead of that one. Do I just like left-click and break it? Like, Oh, my gosh. It does work. Why did I spread this grass all the way down here? Like, seriously, this is from level 65 or something like that. All the way down. I seriously sat here AFK for a good five hours over the last few days and just let it do its thing. In two seconds, I'm able to just to break that and bring it over. Like, uh, sometimes it is way easier than what it seems. So, we are going to let the regular grass itself just spread. I am so happy right now I have the lucky hoe. My gosh. That is awesome. Let me go get a few more pieces and then we'll uh, stay on track. Like I stated in the beginning, even though I have an agenda, I probably won't stay on track at all. I don't know what it is. I just can never stay on track in, when it comes to basically anything. So hopefully we can at least accomplish the uh, the goal of getting something that will allow us to fly today. I'm not sure how hard it is actually going to be to accomplish this. And I added a few other mods. They're both iChun mods and... They're one of my favorite, or excuse me, two of my favorite mods out there. And uh, if I can somehow, uh, no, I, I can actually show it off here. So I have the hats mod. So basically, uh, I didn't know you could customize things. Like I, I've, I've used this a little bit. It's just awesome to see a bunch of random animals wearing hats. But basically the way that you find hats is you don't craft them. You, uh, you basically will find, say, a pig or basically I think it's any mob actually in Minecraft. Just It's just wearing a random hat. And some of them are actually kind of cool. I know... In a live stream that I used to do, it, uh, or excuse me, a, a, what is it, a mod pack that I used to live stream, um, scream? Stream, excuse me. Uh, I actually had, like, a sombrero, and it was, it was kind of cool. Wow, that stuff is already spreading. All right, let's, uh, let's put one for each of these sections here, and I'll just put one down here, and then this last one here. Okay, so this is what we're going to leave it like that. Nice, so let's head back on over here. So the first thing that we're going to need is we're going to make a force rod. So I believe this is actually pretty easy and I should have the materials to make this. What? Wait, where's it going? Okay, okay, there it is. Uh, yeah, okay, so really easy stuff here. Uh, I know I have force ingots and nuggets, so let's head on over here. So I think this works somewhat like the, I guess like the chisel. In Tinker's Construct, if you guys have ever used that, if you put it in the inventory with the block that you want to change, it will actually uh, basically do something special. So what did I say we needed? We needed one of these and one of these and then just a normal stick. Do I have wood on me? Oh, yes, I do. Okay, nice. 
Uh, I forgot about that. I actually went ahead and made sure for once, like, wow, that's something special, that I actually uh, was a little bit prepared here. So, as you can see right now, the durability is at zero, and I believe the way that we change this is... Uh, I'm going to need to get the force shards, whatever those, they might just be called, like, force, uh, I think they are force shards, which of course I don't have any on me, but I can just mine this thing out over here. Alright, so basically, with this, I am able to, oh, force gem, there it is. I am able to now power it, so you just hit the F key, and there we go, oh my gosh, that explosion is ridiculous. Alright, so now I have a little bit of stuff on here, what did I say I needed next? I believe, uh, I have to save this for later. Uh, I need obsidian. Alright, so it looks like we're gonna finally dip into some of these diamonds here and go ahead and make a pickaxe. I really want to find another one so I can actually go ahead and make a second mining turtle, which I should set up as we're doing things. I I went back down there and I actually found the mining turtle. You won't even believe how many deaths it took to actually get all the way down there, but my gosh, there was like a a spawner, which I didn't even know existed. It's It's obviously a mod, but... It was basically a spawner that shot nothing but arrows at you, and I think they were fire arrows. It might have been just because it was next to lava, but it was the biggest troll I think I've ever seen. Oh gosh, don't, no, no, no water, oh my gosh, Minecraft water is such a troll. Alright, let me get these things, speaking of trolls here. I don't know why I never thought of this before, does water hurt them? It does! Oh, that's right, that's right, we're coming in your territory. Let me just... Get them right there. They're like uh, Endermen, where they get hurt in water. Oh, that's right. That's right. Burn. Burn. That is the most atrocious sound I've ever heard. My God. All right, let me just go ahead and grab the sword to finish them off with. Wait, I want to put this bucket here. I have no clue why I'm walking around with a lucky hoe. Really don't need it now. All right, charge. Charge. Oh, don't die. Don't die. Don't die. All right, that should be good. Nice. And that, uh, that weird-looking just... Whatever you would call it, like particle effect. What the heck? What? What is that? Just the the opposite. What? What? Okay. I. Ew! I, I actually morphed into it. My gosh! I'm a lava monster. So this is the other mod that I actually uh went ahead and installed. So this won't hurt me actually. Uh, but let me get away. <laughs> I'll put this down here. So I believe it is. Is it these kills? Okay. So if you hit, I don't even know the name of these keys, I guess the bracket keys, yeah, that's what they're called. If you hit both of them at the same time, you're able to actually change what you want. So you can see right here, uh, I've only killed a lava monster with this mod installed, so I'm able to actually be that. But say if I kill a creeper, I can be a creeper. If I kill a bat, I can be a bat and actually fly around, but I kind of feel like that's a little bit cheap. I'll probably end up using it later on. But for right now, I want to try and actually get armor that will allow me to fly. And then, say when that armor breaks, then we'll just go ahead and be a bat. So I'm going to change back to here. Let me get inside the water. Oh my gosh, things are burning down all over the place. You'd be kind of screwed if you were a lava monster inside of a wooden house. Like, that, uh, that isn't, that's kind of uh, not part of the lava monster code of conduct. I mean, you can't own a wooden house. Oh my gosh. I don't know why these things won't even go, what? Like, why am I just getting random lava effects? Like, okay, I don't know anymore. Let me see, there's definitely, uh, there's definitely lava underneath me, so let me just put that down. Alright, so we're finally making some progress here. I think adding the, uh, the agenda is a good thing, actually. So it keeps us on track a little bit. I do want to go exploring. I, I found a building, I don't know what you would call it. I, I think it's part of the same mod as the, uh, boat that we found the other time. So, I found a building which I haven't explored at all yet, so I have no clue what's even in it. But hopefully it's a ton of loot and we're probably gonna go check that out in this episode and somehow it's like uh, Let me look at the minimap here. What key is it? Is it X? Okay Unfortunately, I can't see it when we're uh, underneath the uh, surface here, but I believe it's in that direction It's seriously not even far at all like my gosh. It's close I have no clue how I missed this thing and then I was just going around getting wood before the episode and I was like my gosh, I've never seen that before look at that Oh, that nice neon green grass that used to be in alpha and beta. Oh, oh, that's so nice. I think they took it out right before. So I guess technically it wasn't always in beta because I think at 1.8 they started changing up the grass and the biome changes. But oh, man, that neon grass and the neon leaves are here too. Like, oh, man. So the reason why we needed the obsidian thing here now is if this works right, if this works right, would ho which uh, hopefully it does, I should just have to right click on it. Or left click, don't, don't be playing with my emotions. It's one of these things here. 
Uh, let me try and give it a little bit more power. Maybe it needs some more. Uh, here's another force gem. I swear it better work. Alright, nice. So, I believe what this, uh, should create. I'll go ahead and look here. I actually named it down here. We're actually starving too. So, I'm gonna need some feathers, but we don't need that exactly right now. We can kind of skip around. I'm trying to see. Maybe I didn't put the name here. It's like a... Oh, man, what is the name of this thing? I'm supposed to be able to right-click on it with the force rod. And it's supposed to change it into somewhat of a table. And let me just put a little bit more in there. Why doesn't it look like the durability changed at all? I could be wrong, but... Wait, what What did it just do? Now it's fully charged. Oh, my gosh, it's at max capacity. So I'm going to just try and break it, maybe? Uh, I don't think this is what I'm supposed to do, though. Don't go trolling me, man. This isn't what it's all about. It's not about trolling me. It's about having fun. Like, I have no clue. Why is it like everything that I uh, that I look up and I want to create, it just never wants to work? Uh, let me just search dark craft itself. I don't think you can craft this thing, so I don't think it's going to help us out that much. And actually, dark craft isn't even an option on here. That's great. So it goes from C to F. Uh, okay. I'm not really sure what's up with the Wait, what? I can get mob spawners. Maybe it's like a subsec uh, subsection here that just got randomly put it. I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I thought I saw it. Gosh dang it. Alright, so let me see. Wait, I think I did just see it. Is it in the forestry tab? Oh, I'm seeing crafted. Okay, I thought I was seeing uh, dark craft. Let me see if I just type in dark craft if this will pop up. I doubt it will. Oh, come on. You've got to be kidding me. I know what's in here. I know what's in here. I wish I could search just dark craft stuff. Uh, actually, I bet you I could with the crafting thing itself. Mate, no, because you're not searching. Huh. We're in a dilemma. What an XP drain. Oh my gosh. Probably create a mob farm with that. That's cool. So I'm trying to see a syringe. <laughs> what? Drafting compass? I'm not really sure what's up with that. I think for now on when I'm looking at the stuff to craft, I'm going to use this instead because unfortunately I can't change where the whole uh, NEI thing is on the right. And my face cam blocks it if it's on like the top rows. So I'm kind of sitting there talking and you guys can't see it. So I do apologize for that. Uh, I will try to use this as much as possible. I really wish I could just search by mods. Hmm, obsidian. I wonder if I just search obsidian here. My gosh, what is that? Wait, a paint maker? What the heck is all this stuff? Sonic glasses, alright. Uh, what? That is probably some pretty good armor right there. Battle mage, battle, oh yeah, it's probably some pretty LP stuff. Uh, I'm really not sure. Why it never wants to work for me at all. Alright, so unfortunately, for some reason, is not wanting to work. Now, I saw that this person had this problem uh, himself. And I believe the way he fixed it is he just logged back in. So let's go ahead and do this real quick here. I want to uh, just go back in here and see if it fixes itself. Please, please. Oh, come on. <laughs> Why do you always have to troll me? Alright, so rather than sitting here for a good five minutes and still yelling at it and having it do nothing, we're going to go ahead and, uh, I don't know, we might actually have to just just do the bat thing in order to fly. Like, I know Darkcraft isn't broken. Maybe they changed the way you do this because we, we have a fully charged force rod, so it's not that that's the problem. Uh, unless you put it in here with it now, is that something? No, it's not something either. Man, I really couldn't tell you. Uh, maybe if I just search through here. Normally mods have, like, uh, mods of the same exact thing. They will be next to each other in NEI. So maybe that's something. I have no clue where all the force stuff is, though. Uh, why do I feel like I miss... Let me, let me just research this real quick. Alright. So we have... We have to get that. Get feathers. Uh, make that... Make a force engine. See, look. And then the first thing that we need is the uh the table here so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna research this on the wiki real quick and i will see you guys in one moment all right so i finally figured out what the problem is i guess they changed the crafting recipe from the uh video that i actually saw so the name of it is the force infuser and instead of just right clicking a thing of obsidian like you were supposed to do i guess now you need an enchantment table and then you also need the force rod which I don't know about that, but hopefully we can uh, we can get a few things here. I'm trying to think. A enchantment table needs two, so that's going to drain our diamond supplies right there. But honestly, I'm pretty sure we'll be able to find a little bit more. Let me place down the uh, mining total here, actually, before I forget. So, 
I'm gonna place it this way because every single time I was walking up there off camera before it was all lit up there it would just always be a mob there so uh, where the dark spot is going to be I want it to be kind of far away from where our uh, our door is there so we don't get bombarded let's go ahead and tunnel it uh, let's just do another 1000 I think 1000 is probably the lucky number here and let's throw the coal in there so hopefully three is enough to get the job done it should be I'm not exactly sure on that but it doesn't take a lot of resources to actually power that. Now we should hopefully be good. I'm trying to think. We are missing some sugar cane, but I believe... I believe I know where I can find some of these if I need to. And the problem is, uh... My bed, it broke here, so I actually really think I know how to get one. I have to go kill myself, though, because it's going to put me back at the original spawn. And if you're wondering, alright, how did your bed break? Basically, a creeper spawned in behind me and, uh, kind of messed my day up. Alright, I'm going to let this thing kill me. Not because he, uh... He, he looks he looks funny. He's just like the coolest mob in Minecraft. That is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. All right, so there should be yes sugar cane right here, and I believe we also need to get leather. Yes, uh, well, yeah. Since one point, I think it was five or something. You need to get leather in order to make books. So we're gonna need that, and uh, that kind of brings us, I guess, to our other thing. We're gonna need the feathers too. So on that agenda list on the board right there. I had a thing called the Force Flask, and hopefully it's still in this update and it works the same way. I'm going to go ahead and type this in here too. Oh wait, I still need that. Uh, Alright, so let's see if this still shows up here. Alright, nice. So with this, I'm able to actually capture mobs and then just bring them down. Rather than having to make a big staircase for them to come down and have all this trouble and just uh, have to get all the wheat. I just right click them, they get in a bottle. And then I just, whatever it is, I don't know if it's right click or left click to get them out. And it's like, oh my gosh, that was the simplest thing I think I've ever seen. So, you saw the crafting recipe there. But the problem is I don't have any sand. Wow. Why am I always really low? Wait, I had sand before because I have glass. Hmm. Alright, so I think this is going to be where we will go on an adventure. And then at the same time, we will grab some sand. Now, I want to just drop off a little bit of things here. I, I so badly just want to throw everything in here. But I want to keep... Nah, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I don't even care. I was keeping this just a cobble only chest. But for right now, I think... Wait, I need that. I don't need that. Uh, I'll keep that too. For right now, I think that I should be good for this. I'll, uh, I'll resort stuff later on. Alright, so that should be all we need. Actually, more than we need. But either way, I will go ahead and take this. Uh, armor, good. That's actually almost broken. That only has 31 hits. Hopefully, there's not a lot of things. Hold on. Hold on, if we find mob spawners, I want to take my force wrench so that we can actually pick a few of them up. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. I hope so much that it's not nighttime yet. Okay, it's kind of like getting there. I think it's about to be sunset, but you can't really tell with all the rain. So, I want to grab some of the sand, and I believe... Yeah, yeah, yeah! There it is right there. You can see it, like, poking its uh, roof out of the top. I'm not sure how I missed that at all. But, uh, we will go there right after I grab a few things of sand here to make the, uh, the flask. And I wonder if I search... No, you can't actually see it on there. I, I have to find some cows, too. I'm not really sure where cows are. There might be a few by the village, which actually, there could be a very good possibility. We'll go check that after this, but hopefully there is. So, I'm trying to see. Uh, 30 should be way more than enough. Honestly, we only needed like four, <laughs> but I'll go ahead and take that. So, now let's do this. Imagine, hopefully by the end of this episode, something like this won't even be a problem. We'll just fly over there. Just, nothing. I, uh, I really want to try and get the armor enchanted, and hopefully it goes like I planned, and it's not like this long and tedious task to do all this stuff. I know it's a little bit, it's a little bit drawn out, so we might not get it this episode, but I'm going to try my hardest. So, this might be a little bit of a, of a long episode here. I'm, I imagine anywhere from an hour to an hour and a half. Uh, so, we will definitely try and get this, what is that, like, scratching sound? I could have sworn I heard something like that last episode, too. I think it's the squids that do that. Alright, wish me luck. Going in. Oh, I love the old, like, ooh, ooh, like that sound. Oh, it's so good. Let me take your paintings. Oh, what up? What are you? What are you? You are like a squid with chainmail. Ew, he's got a tail! He's got a tail! I can now be him. I can now be him. Oh, 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 I wonder what his superpowers are. Can he fly? No. Alright, so I saw a few chests in here. Let me eat your... Ooh, I'll eat your cake. Thank you very much. Alright, nice. Hopefully I'll have enough space in here. Why do I feel like there's going to be something behind me? No? I'm so scared right now. 
Eat some more of this cake. Wow, this guy had a lot of cake just left off. My gosh. <laughs> I think our food problem is solved. 30 bread. Not even, like, below the second floor here. We already... Oh, wow. He only left a lava bucket. Let me check. Does he have another one around here? No. Wait, he has an egg here. I'll take that table. I'll take that table right off your hands. I didn't even know there was a table. Sweet. All right. Uh... So the ladder is there. What does that do? What I feel like it was going to kill me. <laughs> I probably will bet right now that we probably will end up dying at least twice in this raid. What? Oh. Ho, 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 ho. Okay, that guy only has eight health. There's a slime. Okay, get him, get him, get him. Wait, they were both slime. Ew, I'm morphing into the slime now. I'm so small. <gasps> oh, that's right. Let's go in. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, I'm a slime. I'm not a human. I'm, I'm fighting for you guys. I don't like that Steve guy. Oh, no. There are so many of them. I probably should have brought some more torches. All right, so let's just kind of kind of get in here. Oh, man, I can't even... Wait, this is where the slime comes in handy, though. I killed the uh, zombie, so now I turned into him. Chun Chun or Chun Chun is however the heck you say that thing. All right. Uh, let me see. Why can't I jump now? All right, there we go. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Now, he makes a Steve sound. That doesn't make sense. You guys are fighting Steve. Oh my gosh, did I get struck by lightning? What was that? <laughs> I really wish right now that I had a, uh, a bed. Look at that. Uh, uh, uh. They see me rolling. <laughs> That's how slimes roll, man. Why can't I pick up that apple? Like, I have 20 apples. Oh, it's because it's glitching out up on that leaf there. If I just break that leaf, we should be good. Why am I in F5 mode? All right, so let's, uh, let's go back to the latest death here. Oh, I love that feature. Oh my gosh, they all just spawned in again. There's probably going to be quite a few deaths on here. I'm not going to lie. This is kind of cheap. <laughs> oh no, I'm going to end up losing my boots. I do have a, another set of uh, Swiftness Chainmail boots though. So we should hopefully be good. The problem that I'm having is, yeah, something like that. Where they use a special. Our last death was that someone, I guess, blew us up with lightning or something. There was like a, like a god one of these things. A god triton is what they're called. Okay, got him. Nice. Oh, I just morphed into him. I'm one of your kind! Why do you guys kill me? You can just see. This would be so OP. Yeah, there's a guy with a staff! That's probably the guy who shoots lightning. I should probably be killing him right now. Oh! Oh! Okay, we're gonna hop inside, because it's not very nice out there. Where am I? Oh, he can open doors! He can open doors! Get back, get back, get back! Oh, uh, I swear to God, if he hits me. What is he doing? What is he doing? What is he doing? Oh, he just healed up! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That is not right! Crit hit! Crit hit for days! Oh, man. Oh, he dropped a diamond, though. Ooh, I'll take that. All right, so let me shut that. There's some more tables. I'll take all your tables. I mean, I can do some decorating. My Martha Stewart senses are so tingling right now. Oh, I don't even want the cookies, honestly. Those things are trash. What is that? Oh, that's a melon. I'll take that. Wow. So it appears that whatever this mod is that adds these random dungeons, whatever you want to call them, it seems to be pretty op when you actually go ahead and raid them because... We seem to get quite a few things off of just each raid. There's a chicken there, a steak. There. How do I not have, like, any of those in my inventory? Oh, God, they're breaking down the doors. Uh, let's do that. What else don't I need? I don't really need the paintings, but I kind of wanted the paintings. I don't need the eggs, honestly. Uh, we, we'll be able to just put them in a flask after we come back. Oh, man. Wait, 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 wait. Let me eat first. Oh, man, there's so many choices. Don't I have, like, steak or something? I thought I just picked up steak. Like, there's steak right here. Unless I'm just... Oh, Alright, there it is. Alright, so I'll go ahead and take that. I don't know why I even had slime balls in my uh, hot bar there. Alright, so I hear, like, a skeleton walking. Look at the mini-map right now and all the things that are around me. What? Alright, just kind of... Kind of... Whoa! <laughs> Ender pearls for days. We can use these if we get some blaze rods, which I imagine we'll probably end up getting in here. Uh, we can use these to go ahead and actually set up our own end portal, or what? I think it's called the end portal. What? Explain what? Like, huh? That is awesome. Alright, so our latest death was there. I think I'm going to teleport back to the house. Yeah. Uh, I don't have enough stuff at all here. My god. A longbow. Okay, so that texturing is kind of the same. But either way, that is kind of cool. Sharpness 3 fire. Oh my gosh, that is awesome. Alright, so let's teleport back to our house. So far, this has been a pretty good raid. I'm not going to lie. I'm really enjoying this. Now, the problem is I have died quite a few times. But, uh, uh let's just, let's kind of forget about that. How about we? All right. So, 
I know right now it is a complete mess inside this chess room, and I'm sure that one of you have already screamed at me in the comments to go ahead and make like a iron chest or something, which I definitely have to do. What? Ew! Ew! <laughs> the second I saw that arm texture, I was like, wait, what? So what does this thing do? I'm not really sure what that just was. I right clicked on it and it disappeared. Did I eat it? Is it like food? My gosh, there's so much. Let me take... I'll have bread as my primary food source here. All right, we'll just throw in all the rest of this junk. Oh, man, tables and... Should we put the diamonds over here? I'm trying to sort a little bit, but not <laughs> completely here. Oh, we finally have three diamonds, so... Uh, no, I guess we are going to save those for the, the enchantment table. All right, nice. And the reason why I'm saving these is we're going to get some force wood later on, which we'll, we'll need regular oak saplings to actually do that. Now, is there anything else that I need? I'll throw this and that in there, too. Oh, that's a mana cake. I thought that was something actually useful. It could be useful. I'm not going to not gonna bash too hard on the mana cake, but I don't think it's the best thing in the world. All right, so we should be good. Let me just take... I don't really need any pearls right now, so I'll just leave all those in there. All right, let's go back to our latest death. Hopefully, they didn't respawn. No? All right, let's take these here. I'm not really sure what ones I got and what ones I didn't. I'm sure... Oh, my gosh. I'm sure the majority of these just have so much junk. I don't even know what that mod is a part of, like the rune mod or whatever it might be, but it's just blue rune, black rune, like every single one. There's a flower pot there. I'm going to I'm going to restrain. I'm going to restrain. All right. So, let's uh let's morph back down into this little thing here. This is kind of cool. I like the uh the slime. I like that you can actually use things from other mods. I thought it was only for uh for default Minecraft. All right. I see Oh. Oh, he's got a staff, so I'm gonna go for him first. Remember, they can open up doors. Yep, yep. Oh, he's a healer. That's what he does. All right, yeah, so I definitely have to get their healer down. Oh, no, 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 no. He's healing right now. He's healing right now. Gosh dang it. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Come on. Come on. Fight. Fight for. Oh, my God. He would come behind me. <laughs> oh, man. All right, latest death. Here we go. You wanna fight? Wait, what? All right. Hop over here. Oh, my gosh. No. What? Did you just see? I got wrecked so bad there. My armor is... so. How are my boots not just broken yet? Let me get that guy. All right, now I should be good. This guy hurts a lot, though. Oh, he dropped the diamond. Oh, and he regen. Get out of here. He was at one health. If I didn't have the slowness potion, I would have gotten him. My gosh, there's so many deaths. He's, like, burning himself. I'm not really sure what's up with that. Ooh. Uh, that's, what does this do? Aqua Infinity? I imagine the majority of these guys are going to be what they drop or... Uh, what these chests have are gonna be related to water just because obviously the dungeon itself is underwater Wait, did I check the one behind me? I think I checked that one. No, I did. Okay. I love that old chest sound Tick 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 Oh, I love that so much. <laughs> that was the worst impression of a, of a chest that I've ever heard. <laughs> oh Man, all right, so I imagine that there's a little bit more chest. No, <gasps> but hold on Using my head Using my head, look at that. Don't even need the leather. Don't even need the leather. I'll even save this in case we want to make an enchantment table later on. If I had a silk touch, which I don't even know if silk touch axes even exist. I imagine they do if silk touch chose to. Uh, <laughs> but if I had that, I could just take the bookcases themselves. My gosh, how far down does this go? So, it seems like uh, we have two more levels left here. Alright. Uh, this one's actually set up a little bit different. He's, he's waiting for me. Oh, gosh, he's an archer. He's an archer. All right, I got to find their healer. Oh, God, there's more coming in behind me. That guy's got a diamond. Oh, so I think this guy is going to drop a diamond. Oh, my gosh, there's so many of them. I'm not sure if they can all heal. It seems like the diamond ones can heal, and he's not even taking damage. Wait, look at the diamond one. Oh, okay, okay. They're, no, they're not behind me. I'm just really bad. I'm so bad. Get inside. Oh, my gosh, that diamond guy. Why does he take so much damage? Like... The other ones didn't. Oh, now he just teleported. Whoa. Oh, there's lightning. There's lightning. Uh, I'm not really sure. Can I morph into the diamond guy? I want to be the diamond one. <gasps> I can be the healer. Even though I probably can't heal Jack. I'm not sure where that guy just went. Uh, all right. All right, so I have 33 books. If I ever need... Oh, nope. Nope. Wrong neighborhood. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, oh my God. What is this? Okay, so this is the dungeon. I was not expecting this, actually. So there is a skeleton with armor down. Oh, God. There's a skeleton with diamond pants. <laughs> He's got better pants than I do. Oh, sight. No, no, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. 
Uh, let's let's put those nice. Pa oh, oh, so wait, how do the heck do they look on me? They just look like short shorts. Like what? <laughs> I'll take those too. Thorns too. Ooh, okay. Uh, I don't really need that actually. All right, and fire protection. I mean, I just got pants. Ooh, those are actually some really good boots. I I, I like the swiftest ones right now. So if the other ones wear out, then I'll definitely use those. All right, I'm gonna get my horse wrench out here too. Gosh dang it, I left it back up! Gosh dang, I must have left it in, uh, in the chest out here when I died and was resorting things. Alright. Wow, this grass is coming along nicely. I like that grass. I've heard, uh, in the comments, some of you like it, some of you are kind of like, eh. Trust me. It is, uh, it's gonna be real good. Why did I put this in here? After specifically stating that I wanted it? Wait, do I already have these things in here? I'll just throw all the stuff I get from this raid here, even though I just put that other one. Uh, in there last, but I'll put the diamond and uh, I guess just the diamond by itself. Oh wow, I have 30 leather too if I didn't have the books, jeez. Alright, so let's put that diamond there. Four diamond! Count on four diamonds! Alright, let's head back. Oh no, no, uh, latest death. Oh man! Is this the level right here? I believe it is, yeah. Why do I still not have this in my inventory? Or my hot bar? Wait, I want that. Let's put that there, that there. Alright, come on, come on, 1v1 me. Up to tryouts. Now, this is the longbow. I wonder what the difference is. If it does more damage. Oh my god, it does a lot of damage. 11 things? I love the old bow sound too. Like, doom. It almost sounds like a slingshot rather than. What are you? What? Is... Oh no, that's a hat. Okay, okay. I was about to say. Oh no, no, don't right click that. Don't right click that. I'm gonna go grab this. There's a bunch of tables down there. I need the tables. Alright, so I, I at least got the, uh, the spotter there. Even though I got. Very, very badly murdered. My gosh, this is gonna be like 90 deaths in here. No lie. I am so gonna die. Oh, no, no, shut the door, shut the door, shut the door. Gosh, dang. Well, at least I'm gonna spawn right there when I go to latest death. Okay, oh, okay. Never mind, never mind. I forgot that they can open up doors. Oh, wait, let me get that guy. Nice, he was trying to heal. Oh, uh, there's no way. There's no way, unless you had just the most OP armor in the world, which could be a possibility. That you could honestly survive this without dying. I want to see that. I'm sure someone has done it, but I want to see that. Oh my god. And then he teleports. And I can hear him healing too. Oh, respiration. Which, eh. I don't know. I was happy that it was a diamond. Respiration, it's like, meh. Oh, is that another longbow? That's just a regular bow. Get that stuff out of here. Alright, so those are all the chests right there. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff there. Oh my... Random archer. And that was one of the tritons, too. That wasn't even a regular skeleton. Oh, where is he? Where is he? Oh, where's that archer? Where is your archer at? Show No! No! Don't hit! Oh! Oh, I got him! I got him just before- I died so many times. Like, there's nothing to be happy about. About finally killing that guy. Oh, he dropped a, a basic uh, assembly. What the heck? Look at all the melons. What? Alright, so I want to clear them out of here and then grab, like, just all this stuff here. This seems to be... I think there's another spawner probably over there. I'm not really even sure what's down there. My gosh, this is a true dungeon. I don't know if this is what... I imagine there's probably another one below me. I saw another level. Uh, it might be the same exact thing as this. Alright, I think what I'm going to have to do here is change up my strategy a little bit. Even though this is probably the cheapest thing ever. Wow, if I didn't have keep inventory on. I'm not going to lie. I would so be dead right now. Just get that guy. I've got like 18 or something. I'm really digging the longbow. I bet you can craft this too. Way better than the regular bow, which it's only doing three to this guy, but he has a lot of uh, stuff. Ooh, I actually ended up killing him. Nice. All right, let me just try and put down as many of these things. Make a death run. Oh man, there's archers everywhere. There's archers. Oh, what's in here? Like, I want to come back and get all these tables. Like, actually, I might do that right now. I'm going to ransack your table. Okay. Okay. They didn't like that very much. Oh, oh. All right, it's just kind of... Uh, uh. Oh, what? Now look at the longbow. Look at it in my inventory now. That is cool. So it looks like a right... Wait, what? Why did I just throw it? I want my longbow back. What? Why can't I pick up my longbow? I think it's glitched out. Don't tell me it's glitched. All right, do I have it in my inventory? There it is. That was weird. All right. There are like 140-something mods in this. So I, uh, I think some glitches are bound to happen. Let me just go ahead and grab this. Oh, don't. Don't start with that leg. Ah, there's nothing but a bunch of junk. I'll take that, that. Ah, I don't really need that. I'll take that too. Right there, there's a bunch of junk. There could be better stuff uh, later on. What is that? Oh, that's just the outside. All right, I thought that was another, another uh, tunnel. Yeah, same thing there. 
What the heck is this? Is this just a dead end? It appears to be. Yeah, if I ever want to decorate though with that cracked stone, I can come back and get it. I actually think you can craft that, so it's not the uh, biggest find in the world. Is there anything worth even coming down here for? It does seem like it, uh, it gets... Oh! <laughs> worth it right here. Worth it right here, the baby skeleton. That was all worth it. Come on, come on, come on there. Come on down, baby skeleton. Oh! That's more optic tryouts right there. <laughs> FaZe, can I be accepted now? Oh! Oh, there's actually a skeleton spawner right there. He's gonna kill me. Gosh dang. He shoots like poisonous arrows. He's a rare skeleton, so yeah, he's definitely- OH MY GOD! HE'S GOT HIS AIR JOINTS! He's got his air joints! Let me get that guy. How am I not dead yet? Oh, cause he only shoot- No, I, now I died. I thought it was cause he only shot poisonous arrows and you can't die from poison, but... Uh, that didn't seem to be the case. Get it right- Oh, they had to spawn right there, too. They're like killing each other! He's got a nice green hat on, I kinda want that. Can I get it? <gasps> Ooh, I got some green boots though. Oh, it was headphones. All right, so we can put some headphones on. That was actually, I thought that was a uh, an armor piece and it wasn't actually part of the hats mod. <laughs> My gosh, it is so ridiculous. I might not end up killing, like look at how much health, 103 for one skeleton. Yeah, this is so ridiculous. Wait, can I get it? Can I get it? Wait, just, wait, what? He regen, he regen, I so had him. I, what? No! No, this could not be happening! My gosh. It has just been death after death. Get out of here. Get out of here right now. Oh, wow. I want to get back on track and actually go back over to the original thing. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Don't. Okay, nice. I'm not sure if these things will always spawn with armor, so I don't want to place them down right now, but... Uh, if I ever want to make a mob grinder, I will definitely use these. Uh, any mini money mo, I picked the gold. Actually, no, I kind of want the gold. We gotta make some lucky blocks. Ooh, maybe we'll do that next episode. Uh, let me see here. Alright, so that's just a dead end. Oh, is that? Oh, I thought there was a skeleton behind me. There is so much to this dungeon. Like, look at this. It just continues. I still have to go back to the original thing, too. I'm not really sure what is, uh... What is actually the purpose of going down here if you don't want spawners? Because that seems like uh, that's all that you'll actually end up finding. Is it weird that I would rather get rid of 18 gunpowder rather than 14 tables? Like, that's just kind of something I gotta keep on. Okay, I just gotta keep uh, keep that uh, on my person right there at all times. You gotta have tables. I mean, you never know when you're gonna have a house party or something. And you don't want people coming over to your house and eating on the floor. I mean, you gotta get some tables. You gotta always carry some tables. Uh, number one rule of Minecraft. Now, there's a lot of iron here too, I've noticed. But I don't, uh, I don't really need iron that badly. For once, I think. My gosh. Alright, grab it. Oh, man. Uh, I might not even take this, really. <sighs> I'm actually running out of space. Uh, actually, oh wait, I can just put that on. Is there boots I can, that I have that I can put on? I can put, let me just put all this random stuff on. I'm sure I can make better armor later on, like the force armor. But for right now, I'm dying in like one hit. Wait, unbreak? Oh, I'll take that. Lumberjack's hatchet. Oh, I will so take that. Uh, some more torches, some bones, some string, which I can't pick up. Is there... No, okay. So we'll leave the rest of that junk there. Anything else? No, okay. I think that there's one other way. Yeah, through here. And then it just breaks off even more. There's a slime chunk. Oh, no. What the heck is that? Is that the topiary grass? What are you? Oh, my God. Get out of here! What are you? What did he wear? He's wearing a tower, a towering pillar of hats. Oh, I kind of want that. I'm going to put that on. What? Oh, come on. Come right here. Come right here. Yeah, just kind of, kind of walk on that. Oh, what? What? How the heck did the speedy spider do that? He's so speedy. There's blood on it. Look at that. Oh, I even have a spider. Can I actually like latch onto things? Oh, I don't think I can. Come on. Uh, I've only used this mod a few times. And it's awesome, but like I said, I've only used it a few now. I wonder if uh, the skeleton's got to give me something like better with arrows, I bet you. Wait, there was like a way just to get around here the whole time. <laughs> what are you? Ew! <laughs> it's like a, like a gas overdose is what it, my gosh. That gas overdose on something. All right, nice. Yeah, this is like all junk that I don't need. Oh my gosh, get out of here. So I think we're going to get back on track. And, uh, head back over to the, uh, the thing over here, I guess, where the building is. Because right now, if I hit X, look at, my gosh, I might be lost. Like, look at all the 
the, the, the places you could go on that mini map. I had. How have I not found this? Like, how have I honestly not found. What? what, what? No! 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 Oh no. Oh no. Ugh, come on. Oh my. I'm gonna end up spawning back right on there. I have to get on that gravel. Are you kidding me right now? Jump on it. Jump. So basically, it's a trap, is what it is. Alright, nice. They didn't expect that. No! Are you kidding me? <laughs> they did expect that, though. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, so I should be good now. What is that that is just, like, crying? My God. <laughs> what? I need to get out of here quick. Oh, I knew there was going to be something behind me pretty soon. What? I, I, I don't even know. I am so freaked out right now. Uh, ooh, strength. Eh, I don't really need it. Oh, I'll take the blaze powder, though. I would definitely take that for later on. What do I need? What do I need? What do I, well, what do I, what do I not need? Oh, I don't need that stuff. The, uh, I'd rather take coal over that. Okay, and I think we already checked that. Come on, I just want to get back home. Oh, man. It has been a journey. I am so glad I went over to this thing, because uh, I've had a ton of fun in this dungeon right now. I believe if I can navigate correctly, that it's going to be to my right here. It, it appears to be. Yes, okay, good. Wow, I, I looted, yeah, I looted that. Uh, what? Oh, no, I threw that down. Ew, look at that arm! Yeah, yeah which one? Oh, 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 I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Get inside, get inside, get inside. My gosh. Just when you think everything is going right, that's when everything goes wrong. Okay, get out of here, get out of here. Oh, yeah, here's where the deaths occur again. Let me get that guy who has two health. Don't let him, like, oh, my gosh. That is one of the most irritating things. Oh, he's right behind me. Get him, get him. Don't let him reheal. Nice. Oh, this guy's going to be a pain. Oh, of course they would have teleporting archers. Why not? What is this even part of? Like, what mod are these triton things even for? Oh, my gosh. Is a triton even a creature? Like, I've always called these weird-looking things that are half, like, human, half fishtail, mermaid-looking things. Like, uh, I don't know, sea monsters or serpents, sea serpents or something. Like, you think that would be more of an appropriate name for him, and this guy just here. Oh, the, the spawn trap is worse than Nuketown right now. Like, jeez. Die. There's another level I can see that it opens up to. That is where we're going to end up going into next here. As long as I don't fall into it right now. Okay. Why is there a clock on the ground? Like, who honestly has ever needed a clock? I guess maybe the first time you hear about it, you're like, oh, man, I want to try that out. It's probably really good. Not really. All right, what am I missing here? Missing boots. Uh, there are some feather falling, which... Eh, they're better than nothing, I guess. So let me throw those on. I know I passed up boots earlier, but I wasn't really in need of them at that time. What? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> that zombie's like, no. No. No, I don't think so, dude. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, my God. That sword does a whole lot more damage than my diamond. Why was I not using that earlier? Now, how much does this thing do? That has just nothing. It has smite and knockback, so I'll use that. Uh, I choose Iron Helmet. <laughs> My priorities are definitely <laughs> set pretty straight. <laughs> oh, man. All right, I think I looted this one, too. No, I didn't. Okay. I don't really need two apples. We have a ton of stuff. All right. Let me just go ahead and eat up there. Oh my god. No! That looks to be just like a whole nother dungeon. Just as this looks to be. So, I think we're gonna wrap it, uh, wrap it up here with this dungeon. What? But I want that. I so want that. I want that. Pants or hat pants? What? Oh, wait, wait. I forgot we have a whole nother level. Oh, man. Are you kidding me? I have a whole nother level of this? Oh, no. Okay, just shut that. And now there's there's more about Oh, wait, they're fighting. Right, I take bets on the one who's winning. That's how, that's how you bet right there. Best betting ever. I know from this keep inventory thing that it is just insanely cheap. But do you know, we wouldn't even be past, like, level 1 right now if I didn't have keep inventory on. Like, that's, that's not like a, like a statement. That's a fact. That's a fact of life <laughs> that I am just that bad. Wait a minute, let me take one of these beds so that next time I need them. Uh, cause like I stated earlier, my bed is broken right now. It's in the shop being repaired. Uh, good thing I had a warranty on my Serta mattress. I think right now is where we, uh, we part ways with this piece of coal. Or those four pieces of coal. What's in here? Probably food? Ooh. Eh, I don't really need it. It's not that good. Okay. 
Okay, you're something new. You are definitely something new. Okay, what one was the lumberjack one and what one's just a regular? Alright, I didn't need you. And I hear things opening. They're probably gonna come in and try and kill me here in a sec. I love- That is not a di- What? It explodes? It what are you? Are you like in prison? I'm here to save you! I'm here to save you, my queen! Not really. My queen doesn't want me. Alright, let's turn that on. I think he was in like prison. What the heck? Maybe he disobeyed the orders like he was one of them. I'm trying to help that guy out. What are they? Okay, so they're attracted to something. Does this thing even do anything? Oh god, it like lags like the ridiculous the second I let go of that. I took my thing! No! No, you didn't! No, you did Yeah. Uh <laughs> What? No! Is it just a one shot every time now? Okay, that was just a weird coincidence. Where's my sword at now? But they are just like so hardcore destroying me right now. Okay, die, 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 die. 103 health at skeleton head. Let me get this guy. Don't heal, don't heal. Okay, nice. What happened to my sword? I don't have it anymore. No! The one thing I loved. You witnessed it. You now must die. Oh, okay, okay. Never mind. I was joking about that. I'm just going to take this. I don't think we're, we're any more even going to deal with these things. We're going back to the mine. The death count is probably, like, to another level. I don't even want to begin to even guess. Oh, wow. If I had to take a guess, though, it'd probably be about 52. Let's go. Eh, it might be a little bit high. 52. I'm, I'm still going to stick with 52. All right, so now we have a ton of uh, spawners and just junk that I'm sure is pretty hard to get uh, in the long run. Wait, all those things just now combined into one thing. Hmm. I wonder if they'll just all be pig spawners later on. You know the reason why we went over there in the first place? It was just to get some sand. It was just to get some sand. <laughs> so let me go ahead and uh, smelt this down in the glass. Oh, I forgot I had that in there. All right, nice. My gosh. The most extreme sand excavation trip extravaganza uh, that I have ever seen. Right, let me add that to the stack. Now we have a full stack of uh, ender pearls, unless it's there's a mod that lets you stack more than 16, but I believe that is a full stack. Is any of the armor broken? No, but I remember putting those leggings on at about level 2 or so. It might have been like 4. Yeah, anywhere from 2 to 4. And they're pretty much broken. They're, they're halfway, and those boots are uh, under halfway. Like, my gosh. Alright, now I believe with this, if the crafting recipe is working, there's a zombie breaking down the door there, but... From what I've noticed is they don't actually appear to be able to break it. It's weird. Uh, I don't know why they can't. So let's put on a hat here real quick. So should I put on some hat? Like some hat pants? I guess such a... Let's see some hat pants here. Oh, wait, wait. I think I have to apply it. I think that's what I have to do. Let's go... Wait, what? Why does it look like I had two... So what? How do I dual wheel the other one? Hold on. Hold... Wait, what? Wait. How do I... Is it just there for show? I think it is. Yeah. I think it's just a glitch because it's a, it's a different mod and that guy normally has a stone sword. If I could dual wield those things, my gosh. I know there's a few mods that let you dual wield, but mm, wow. <laughs> that would be pretty ridiculous. All right, there we go. Oh, <laughs> wow. So I'm trying to think right now. We have all those books in one of these chests over. Oh, okay, this thing's annoying the heck out of me. Let me just kill this. Because the whole breaking down of a door is really annoying. Get- Oh, wow, there's two of them. Oh, no, there's like an ultra mega super one. Okay, nice. Look, this is like a random thing I've been noticing. It was all bright here earlier, and now it's dark. I don't know if zombies take down torches or what it is. I might have to start putting glass in front of where I place the torches because they just completely disappear. That Yeah, that would probably be the next step right there. I, uh, or, or glowstone. Maybe they can't break glowstone, but... Yeah, they're getting pretty annoying with that. Oh, this looks so nice now. Oh, yeah, it's going to look so nice once we actually put the other room back there for the, uh... Oh, what is it? For the Tinker's Construct stuff, which we have to get into pretty soon. But, uh, now I should be able to start getting ready to make this Force Infuser, I think it's called. So let's go ahead and get this. What else do you need? You need diamonds? I'm trying to think. Oh, I'm going to need some more obsidian. Yes, that is right. I think I actually got some obsidian. No, I didn't get any off of them. I thought they dropped some. All right, I can actually go ahead and gather this one just to save a little bit of time here. So, 
We need four total obsidian to make an enchantment table. I think we have everything else. We have the two diamonds, the book. Yeah, so we just need to go and get four, or excuse me, two more obsidian, and then we should be good. I wonder if I can force wrench it. Because I know you can force wrench ice. Oh, that would be such a good time saver. Let's see if that will actually work. I doubt it, but it's worth a shot. I mean, if it's going to sit there and save us some time, it's uh, it'll definitely be cool if it works. Ah, come on. Why does nothing cool ever work? All right, so let's go ahead and gather up a lot of this obsidian. This has been so fun. My gosh. Even though I got just completely destroyed and uh, I'm probably known as the worst Minecraft player ever. Try to play the mod, uh, excuse me, the Mad Pack if you guys have never played it. Because it is ridiculously hard. And uh, you'll kind of know where I'm coming from. I don't care if you are the best Hunger Games player ever. Whatever it might be, Skyblock, any PvP I always mess up on that. I don't know why, even though PvP is what I do the most on my channel. Any PvP uh, mini game that you're good at, that is that just all goes away. Like you don't get any credit for that when you play the Mad Pack. It is so hard to survive when 90 something Tritons are coming after you. <sighs> that life. All right, so let's throw that that Minecraft tough life. My gosh, I've got about the diamonds. I hate that when you do that when you have everything set up and you're like, oh. I've got it all placed here, but I need diamonds or whatever it might be that you missed out. All right, so if they haven't changed the crafting recipe, there we go. So it was just this and this. Nice! So this should allow us to go ahead and uh, I guess it's kind of like an enchantment table for the dark craft mod. It lets you customize things a little bit more. You can put things like sharpness and I believe other things next to it. Actually, hold on. Please let me, please let me break this. Oh, I don't think I can. I don't think okay rather than breaking that and feeling sorry for myself uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and place this one over and the reason why I need to do that is we're gonna need to make an engine and then attach it to it later on so it will actually be able to power itself let me change back this this like claw or like squid hand thing is really oh I want to be the the thief skeleton let me let me see that oh did I get some cool shades oh wait he just looks like a normal skeleton now like why well, don't you get any shades in the picture he had shades that's false advertising. Like, look at him. He has, like... Oh, he has, like, the normal bandit things. That's what he has. He doesn't have sunglasses. All right. Uh... I might just change back here. I wonder if I went to be the uh, lava monster. If it would just burn everything. I don't even want to try that right now. All right. So, what did I say we needed? We have this now. We're going to need a few more of these, uh... Force gem. Yes, force gem things. But they're called something else. Like, light stone or... Whatever they are when they're just their own ore that you mine. But whatever it is... Uh, so let's go ahead and look here. So we're gonna need some feathers I think this is where we are going to go ahead and capture some chickens And I don't know if you guys saw but I know of at least one chicken at the spawn when I die So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I want to place this bed down. I don't want to sleep on it just yet I want to kill myself one more time, which I'm not really sure how I'm gonna do this Jump from a high place. I guess actually I bet you right now if it's nighttime and I oh of course it, it is the brightest day you can possibly think of any other time it is just completely night here. I actually think I can kill myself on this. Alright, so hopefully with this I can go ahead and kill myself. Uh, yeah, with the starving mod, I'm sure I can. Oh, yeah. Let the painful death, painful slow death uh, come in. Is it not going to kill me? Alright, so maybe it's just going to be dumb. I could just shoot some arrows up in the air and just let it kill myself. That doesn't work anymore? Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, there we go. <laughs> a waste of uh, a few good arrows. Now, I believe I saw a chicken over here. I think I can only put one chicken per flask in it. But either way, we can come back here. Look at that 3D modeling, too, on the flask. That's kind of cool. The little, uh, what do you call those? Like, uh, corkscrews? I, I don't even know. Whatever that, like, wood thing is at the top of the bottle. Oh, what is the name of that thing? I know it starts with a C. Ho! Oh, can I just, like, right click? Like, how do I get you? Is it, I think it's, uh, I think it's left click. Oh no, I heard him! Oh no, I have him in here. Okay, good, good, good. A bottle chicken. Look at him in that bottle! I didn't know he was that small. Emilio, you never told me that. I probably should have made two of these, honestly. But either way, now we can come back. So, uh, we will go ahead and set up... Where do I want to put this? I don't want to make a chicken farm just yet. Actually, I might go ahead and do that. I think that might be a, uh, a thing we can do here. Where do I want to put it, though? That's the question. I think we'll probably... Instead of making a mine this way, we'll just put all the animals over here. That wouldn't be half bad. All right. So I'm trying to think what we could do to actually have this here. Uh, I'm pretty sure right now 
that the mining turtle thing is so far gone. Why is the lighting weird? Like, if you look at the XP bar, like, the green changes every now and then. It's not, of course it's not doing it now. It was, do like, look at the mini-map. It's, like, changing lighting. That's weird. But, uh, I don't know how far this thing actually went. It seems like immediately as soon as it mined in, it just went ahead. Oh, wow, it only went that far because I re-logged. Gosh dang it. <laughs> well, either way. And now I believe I can actually just place this down. So I'm going to place it right in the water source. And it becomes like its own block, I think. Wait, wait, wait. Where did it go? Chicken. Chick. Where did my chicken go? Gosh dang it. You can't believe everything you, you listen to on YouTube. Uh, but it might just be around here. I can't see him. Let me see. Where is the bottled chicken now? Uh, I could have sworn if you... If you Hit Q. Now I gotta go get myself another chicken! Oh wait, wait, there he is! Yeah, yeah, so look, he becomes his own block. It's not like I pick him up, and I think if I just... Like, eh, oh, don't! I hear that, don't! <laughs> that is so cool. Wait, what? What is up with the lighting right now? What the heck? Oh, wait, am I, uh, am I like a... A certain mob? Oh, it might be because I was like a different mob? What the heck is going on with the light? That is weird. Like, you can see, it's like when I go into dark zones now. It's, it's not doing it right now, I don't think. Yeah, it's, I don't know. We can push through. I have no clue what that is, though. Wow. Alright, so I will let this mine total help me out a little bit here. I want to make this very short and sweet. Yeah, you can see it. What the heck? I have no clue. Maybe if I just try and re-log here and see? But that is weird. That is really weird. Alright, please tell me that fixes it. Uh, it's nice and bright right now. But I think it fixed it. Yeah, look at that longbow. It is, like, compare that to a regular bow. You can see it there. Oh, it's still changed. That is so weird. Like, I'm a regular human. I don't know why it puts me into, like, a lava mob. Or a monster at the beginning. What if I change this? Uh, It might be an effect that I have. I'm not... That is one of the most annoying things I've ever seen. Why is this happening? It's got to be something. It's not the, uh... Like, the, the recording itself. It's Minecraft. That is weird. Alright. Oh, man. This feels so weird now. Tunnel. Tunnel what? How far out do I want? I'll, I'll make it tunnel 20 out. So, we'll just have a little farm here for now. The lighting is... What is this? What did I just, like, turn on? I have bright lighting on. Is it smooth lighting, maybe? I think that might be it. Is that my, my case of... No! It's still doing it. Like, you can see everything get dim. It's weird, because only the text itself gets dim. But if you click on here, you can see it's dim. That is so weird. Oh, man. Hopefully, I can figure this out. Why did it just happen like that? I think it might be an effect that I have. I have got to go, like, just drown myself in lava and see this. So, we'll let the mining turtle do its thing there. It's, it has to be something. It only says at the top right right now for me that I'm hungry. So, I'm not sure what it exactly it's doing. Yes, just kill me. Just kill me. I'll, I'll sit right here. But it's just damaging my armor like mad. So, let me take that off. Come on! Why did it take so long to kill me? You're such a bad lava monster. You're such a bad one. Alright, this guy. Oh, wait. There we go. Wow, I just, like, lost. Are you kidding me right now? He sat there and he stared at me and he didn't even do anything. My gosh, the lighting is so strange right now. All right, let me just kind of, uh, there we go. Please tell me this fixes it. All right, seems to be good right now. All right, but I don't think above ground is where it matters. I think it's when I go underground. Why does the spawn look so much different? I don't remember that big tree being there. Maybe it was. I, I swear to God, that thing wasn't there. Here's a cool little tip I actually learned uh, when I died, when I was just kind of doing maintenance. The town is right there. How I didn't see that, we seriously walked that way. Like, you can see where our home coordinates are. And I didn't turn my head just a little bit more to the right. My gosh. All right, let's see if this fixes it. If it doesn't, I don't know why. It, it doesn't. What could it possibly be? Is it the hat itself? Maybe that's it? I, I, I mean, we didn't have a hat on. That couldn't be it, could it? I mean, I, I removed the hat now. Oh, when simple little things like this happen, and I don't know the answer to them, it annoys the heck out of me. <sighs> like, what the... I, I, we're just gonna truck on here, I don't know. Like I said, it's not the recording, so if, if you're like, oh, the, the recording's all messed up or something, I don't really know what's up with it, but 
We'll just, we'll truck on here. All right, so it's out the tunnel. Another 20 here. And I just, oh wait, I need to give it fuel. That'd probably help. All right, nice. Now I'm trying to think, maybe if I just, uh, I do want to make a chicken pen, but it's going to take a little bit to actually get it set up and ready to go. I guess I'll help it out a little bit. Oh, wow, I didn't know the thing was right here. Oh, never mind, never mind. That's just that little like cave and i have no clue why it's like that i guess we could we could easily put like a ladder right there if we want to feed a bunch of chickens down here i'm not sure how i really want to do this just yet what i think i'm gonna do is we'll put grass in here later on uh ooh, that's actually gonna be very hard if i have a lot of chickens we'll figure out something maybe i'll kill them like that that is so just not acceptable at all i have no clue why the color changes and i can see it on the recording too it's Really strange that we've gone through this whole entire session, nothing has happened, and now it decides to randomly bug out. I'm not sure. Alright, so I think for now, I'll just make myself a nice small chicken pen, and then I'll, later on, we'll have like a factory grade. We'll have a, uh, a, uh, what's like a big company? Like a Microsoft grade, uh, chicken farm. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, so we'll do something like that. I do want to raise the roof. Raise the roof a little bit more here. Uh, so that my chickens aren't feeling like they're suffocated. But at the same time, they're uh, they're getting their, uh, their heads a little bit poked out here. So I'm trying to see. Do I have any dirt? I wonder if I have dirt inside my chest. I should have at least a few more dirt from actually getting it off. Alright, how much is that grass spread? Wow, that is actually almost all the grass right there. Just in like an hour or so of playing, like we've almost gotten a full thing of grass all fixed there. Nice! Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and... Actually, you know what? I'll do this right here, but the the fence or the wall, whatever I'm going to... I think I'm going to use a wall, just like a regular cobblestone wall right now. In the past, what I've noticed, if you use fences with chickens, they tend to glitch up against it. And some of them will actually get out. For I, I don't know why. But, uh, they'll just glitch right through the wall. What is it? Like, there's a cobble wall now in Minecraft or a fence. So, I think right now, just to use a regular, uh, like, standard method of putting cobblestone and making a wall out of that. Instead of making, like, uh, like the walls themselves. Is it, is it what they call a cobble? Just, like, wall? Yeah, these things right here. Instead of that, we're just gonna make a wall with a regular, uh, cobble. If that made any sense. Hopefully it did. Uh, now let's see. From here... Uh, do I not have any dirt? Like, really? How do I not have any dirt? I have all this junk. There we go. Okay. That should be hopefully enough. I mean, the farm isn't that big. So later on, I will extend the grass to come over here and uh, let it do its thing. Uh, actually, you know what? What I could do right now is I could just go ahead and... I'll, I'll use the lucky hoe. That's what I'll do. All right. Sounds good. So rather than having to extend it, I can just go ahead and place one thing of grass in here and let it do its thing. Thank you so much for whoever told me that, that the lucky hoe uh, with efficiency allows you just to take grass i would have never have thought of that in a million years so thank you so much and one of the weird things is it doesn't take up the durability of it when i first got it, i was like oh the lucky hoe i mean that's cool i guess not really worth it why did i just put grass back in there like i'm gonna need that grass to patch in this hole here i'll throw that down just for now and come pick it up later <laughs> i am uh, i'm a little bit off right now all right so we'll throw that meteor chip there where did i put the the grass here so I can patch that up. Nice. This lighting bug is annoying the heck out of me. Whatever this is, I really hope that it goes away a little bit. Like, I don't have a side... It, the only side effect I have right now is being hungry. And even that, like, I've had that many times in this series. So I'm not sure why it's just now deciding to screw with me. If it is that thing right there. Alright, so... The, the just probably uh, worst looking chicken pan ever. It is probably very... Very uh, low budget. It's almost like this uh, this farm is not FDA approved. Let's just put it that way. The uh, we're not really able to sell to registered meat dealers <laughs> per se. We kind of do a black market chicken selling uh, thing here because we're wanted in 33 different countries for uh, I guess uh, what would you call it? Mistreatment of chickens. Like, this, this pen right here, chickens are lucky to get at least one meal a day. Uh, alright. I'm gonna stop with the lore. Now, let me just go ahead and place this here. Later on, I'll make a ladder. It needs to go up one more, actually. 
Oh man. So hopefully all this stuff works here. Once I actually get this stuff. And the reason why I need these feathers is you need something called, I think it's rocks feathers. It's rocks something and then feathers. I believe it's rocks feathers. And that will allow you to put the enchantment of flying onto your stuff. Now I believe I will need to go ahead and enchant other things first of all. Uh, the video that I saw wasn't that clear on this kind of uh, uh, step in the process. But I believe... Say I need to get the level up a little bit and there's this thing called a tone book inside the uh, Infuser itself and with that I think I need to go ahead and nice all right, so with that I believe I need to Actually get this tone book up. So if we right click on here, which it's not showing up right now But I believe later on it will once I put in some force gems, which we definitely need right now Huh, I'm sure somewhere. I have a few of them and if not uh, in the chest we can easily find some yeah, there's like none here. Of course, there would be none here. Uh, actually, I think I can use this. Uh, I might be able to use that inside the engine itself that we will go ahead and make. I'm trying to see. So we have one chicken. We have to go back and now uh, die again. So I'm going to go back into this lava pit over here. And then we're going to head back over and grab one more chicken. The problem is we're going to need to kill some chickens. And... I'm not all about killing the Emilios, the chickens, and for those of you who don't know who Emilio is, because I know I've gained a few uh, subscribers in the past few days, and thank you so much for subscribing, I hope you guys are enjoying the video thus far, but uh, Emilio is basically, I don't know how this started, it was like two and a half years ago, I used to do this series called Minecraft with Chris, and we actually have a 2.0 version that's on hold a little bit for now, he's just kind of busy, but hopefully we'll get that back up and running later on, but uh, we used to have this series where we just kind of play with a bunch of mods, and I guess the, the original version had no mods, and now I put like 90-something mods in it, and uh, make a custom mod pack. But basically, uh, we just go and play with each other and just see how that goes, and uh, I somehow ended up having a pet chicken, and I named him Emilio. I don't know why, I have no clue uh, the rhyme or reason for his name being Emilio at all, but that's just kind of how it played out. I can't seriously craft feathers. Like, I don't want to do this, man. I don't want to... I don't want to have to hurt chicken. Gosh dang it, I can't. Oh, man. How many feathers do I need for these rocks feathers? Let's go ahead and look this up. Where are they? They should be, like, red feathers. Here they are. Oh, I need glowstones. We have to make a trip to the... Ah, oh, to the nether, too. My gosh. It is going to be a process here. But either way, hopefully we can get there. I'm not really sure where I'm even going to put these. I wanted to have a designated spot for them so that they would actually work good together. <laughs> wow, this this wall is so atrocious. I know it's real bad right now. Later on, I'll go through, and if we have like a ton of them in here, I'll slaughter them all, take two, and uh, make this a bit better. Put some glass and extend it and make it FBA approved, but for right now, it is very atrocious looking, so <laughs> don't judge me on my, uh, on my pen building skills just right now. I'm trying to see. So much junk in here. So, I think what I'm going to do from here, the next step, is probably to go ahead and try and get some force gems and get this stuff going here. And then we're going to make a sword, get the tone to level up, and hopefully uh, things should go as planned. Now, they never seem to, so I'm hope I, uh, I imagine that we'll end up running into some problems here. Wow, we had a lot of just random tools there. Look at it. They're all enchanted, too, except for the diamond one. Sweet. That lucky hoe is so lucky. All right, uh, from here, so hopefully if I go over here that we should end up finding some force gems. Or what are these things called? Light something, I believe they are. Let's see here. Uh, power ore. How is that that far off? I knew it wasn't like force ore or something. Why they call it power ore, I don't really know, but, uh, I'm not really the creator of the mod, so I guess you can call it whatever he wants. And I actually am really enjoying Darkcraft. I've never heard of this mod at all. I'm not sure if it's a new mod or what it is, like... How I haven't heard of this mod before, I don't know, because normally I'm pretty on it when it comes to mods, but, yeah, I, <laughs> the first time I've ever heard of this thing, and it's really cool, too, so, yeah, I imagine it doesn't get a lot of popularity, or I've just, somehow, I've been underneath a rock when it comes to that mod, so, let me see, there's some more here, with some lava right next to it, now, the problem that I've noticed with these power ore things is, it only seems like there's one, uh, in itself, and I, I don't really find a lot of clusters of them, I'm sure that they exist, and there's another one down here. But for the most part, I don't find them in clusters. Now, why is none of this lit up? I made sure before this that I had all these torches just completely lit up. I actually went through and, che and uh, tested all the light levels just to make sure that it was good. And you come back and it's like, nope, 
Look at everything there. This right here is where that spawner that I was talking about earlier where the arrows shoot. So if I get close, you can actually hear it shoot all the arrows. My gosh. And you can see the uh, the fire arrow right there sticking out. Like, stuff doesn't play around. That was like two or three deaths right there by itself trying to <laughs> make a wall there. And it, now, I don't want to speak too soon, but it does seem like the light bug has gone away. I could be just saying things down, getting used to it, but I think it's gone away. So sweet. Uh... I think I throw it in there. Nice. So that will give us a little bit of power. And now from here, I believe that we are going to need to make an engine. Now, I think I actually have all the necessary things to make the force engine. Uh, should be good there. All right, sweet. So I think later on, I, I don't know. Actually, no, we will need some saplings for this. So uh, in order to make the tools, but uh i'm not really sure if we can bone mill those or not hopefully we don't have to wait for those so right now we need to go ahead and make ourselves a force engine which it's almost like every other engine why do i always spell force wrong there we go uh let's just type in force engine here is it not gonna work is it just one word like what okay there we go i was just on the previous uh so what is this right here it's, like i said it's almost like every other engine just with the force it gets themselves so i kind of know how to make this i believe it's an industrial craft so i'm really sure that uh really surprised that they uh, kind of cross mods there. I love it when mods do that when they actually work together and they're not even part of the same thing. Like the Morse mod and allowing you to be able to morph into other mods that, uh, like, what, probably at the time that, that mod was made, like, that mod didn't even exist. So I've already coded that. It's kind of cool. Alright, uh, from there. Oh, wait, wait. We need the force things now. Now, I believe we need two of these gears. Let me just confirm that. Yes, alright. So we're going to need to make another one of these and like the simplest thing ever it just kind of it takes a little bit it's not really resource demanding at all it, as you can see it just it's clicking and clicking and clicking over and over all right so there we go there's our two force gears we need to now make ourselves a piston which is pretty easy i need some redstone for that nice now i always get tripped up on a piston and i want to see if i can get this right i always get the iron and the redstone mixed up i think it's like that so hopefully I get that one right. But normally I'll either, uh, I'll either put one. Oh, I did get it. Normally I'll put like the iron at the bottom or the, instead of the, like this right here. And it just won't work. Does it actually, is it a shapeless crafting? No, it's still not. Why have they not updated that? Either way, there's our piston. So what else do we need? We just need, wow, we just need the glass. And I believe I have one extra piece of glass here. And then I have all the glass that was smelting in there from earlier. Uh, let's just go and grab that. I know I have it in there somewhere. Actually, I might have used it now that I think about it. So we'll come back here and we will go ahead and throw down. Let me just make sure I have everything before I start it. Yes, all right, so I should have everything here. Uh, let's go off of memory. <laughs> Two seconds ago, my memory is so strong, which I'll probably still end up messing it up. There we go, so there's our force engine. We should just be able to put this right next to it and it should work. I'm not sure if it needs a, uh, a lever next to it to actually power it, but either way, that should be good. Now, I believe it would just take either this fuel here which we just randomly found in like a dungeon so hopefully it works like this uh oh did it i think it did sweet it did nice i wasn't actually sure what i was even going to use that for i believe actually if you throw it down you can actually heal up i'm not entirely sure okay never mind that just gave me i think they just gave me mining fatigue yep it did and it gave me slowness that's great i, I know that there's something that will actually let you heal up i think it's still that it just might be a side effect that you get mining fatigue, but I think it regens your hearts. Let's go ahead and use the rest of this stuff here, and I don't think, yeah. All right, so it's almost halfway. That should be good for what we need it for. If not, uh, the other way we can do that is just by getting some more force gems and throwing them in there. Hopefully now we should almost be there. I just need to go ahead and craft myself a force sapling, and like I stated uh, a few minutes ago, hopefully these things will allow me to bone mail them. So I have all these bones here that are ready to be used on this now i think it's just this correct maybe they change it or it might just be this there we go all right so a force sapling with that and where should i place this hmm i'm just thinking about maybe placing it right here and trying to bone meal it i mean wait what do i have an infinite amount oh i must get two out of it now did i get two out of it or did i click it twice i might have clicked it twice and just not have noticed please tell me you Either it won't grow in here or it just doesn't work on bone mail. Or it doesn't work with bone mail. Please tell me you work out here. Come on. Come on. The crowd's cheering for you. The crowd is cheering. Nice! 
Oh, I'm so glad that, that worked. So we'll probably just make a farm of these things later on. Which I might just go ahead and leave one down here. I imagine these things probably just drop four saplings too. Oh, that mining fatigue. So I need this to create the tools themselves. So I'll just throw that one down there. And hopefully it doesn't spawn. And let me let me put this a little bit away from that uh, waypoint there. So it doesn't spawn me in there and I die. All right. Uh, I'm trying to see from here. We should be able to now almost be good. Uh, gosh, that slowness. Well, it is, it is kind of my own dumb fault for not eating. So let me go ahead and do that. As you can hear my voice, it is like going out right now. So I'm going to go ahead and take a drink real quick. And uh, let uh, let everything... I was going to say let everything get smelting smelt. But we actually don't have anything there. Alright. <clears throat> Still. Just blah. But I've done six hour live stream. So it, uh, it doesn't uh, hurt that much. This video is going to be a pain to upload though. Either way, I enjoy doing long episodes. Let me know if you guys would like them short. But maybe daily. Uh, I could maybe just cut up a session that I do. I was thinking about that. Or if you like them long like this. And maybe every other day like I've been doing. Uh, I, I don't know. I honestly couldn't do them long. And then uh, at the same time keep them daily. Maybe it would be a stretch. But I don't really know. Now from here. I don't know all the enchantments. For, but from what I watched of a video. I know if you get claws. Which I believe I have. Yeah I have a few of these saved up here. You can actually put them on this, and this is basically the equivalent of, I think, a um, sharpness. So if I put, please tell me, please tell. What is not working here? Uh, I think I need, I need to get this in here. So I believe I need to get a lever next to it. Yeah. Okay. So lever, I think, is just cobblestone. Like it's not even stone. It's one of the easiest things to make. All right. So there we go. And for some reason, I would always mess that up when I wasn't thinking i was like oh i gotta get stone wait a second it's just cobblestone so simple so it should be able to place that nice so you'll see the mjs get up here i think it had the michael jordans to see them get up there i uh i think it has to get up a little bit in order for me to actually be able to use this let me see yeah so a little bit here unless this just doesn't work for it anymore that could be a possibility but i'll i'll give it a second and let it uh get a little bit of power here i'm not sure how much it uses hopefully we should have enough liquid force in here to actually do that it, it is draining uh if you at any point in this episode think that i'm a pro at this think again because i i really am just trying to trying to think it wait what is this uh if you haven't already done so you should make a book of uh madora i think yeah i guess Dora the explorer as it contains the sum of all dark craft knowledge simple force transmute okay so how do we make this stuff this is another curveball uh, what is it called? The Book of Medora. Oh, that's wrong button. Okay. Hopefully this is easy and it's not like journey to the center of the earth to get this thing. We still do have to go to the nether, so I guess it's technically like a uh, journey to the center of the earth here. Uh, duh, 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 duh. why are you not sure? Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. That's easy. All right. Nice. So I have all these books here. Wow. I didn't actually expect it to be that easy to make. Nice. So, I think that this might be what we have to use to go ahead and, uh, I think this is the tome book that I wrote down on the agenda over there. They, they might have changed a few things, like they changed the crafting recipe for the infuser itself. So, let me just right click here and see, oh, wait, 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 I need that and what else? Oh, that and the thing itself, there we go. I didn't have the book just yet. Alright, so that should be good. Let me just try and right click here and see if it goes to its special spot. I think it goes here. No? Like, where does this thing go? Oh my gosh, what? Alright, so what is this supposed to help me out with? <laughs> I'm not really sure. Uh, the force infuser is more... A, I like that this is almost like Tinker's Construct. What will tell me what's going on here. I always love that about Tinker's Construct. The force infuser is, is a more dark craft way of enchanting your force tools and armor. To make a force infuser... Yeah, we already did that. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, so how do we get this? Hopefully now I should be able to place these here. Why can I not? It's got to have enough Michael Jordans in it to be able to do this. I'm not sure. The force infuser can be used to your force tool. In what the heck is Imbu? In boo I think that's how you say it. I, I apologize that my face came as blocking it. Uh, your force tools with special upgrades that range from vanilla fortune to auto grinding or even wacky s auto grinding. What? Oh, how do I do this? So, what if I put like this? No, 
Now, if I can remember, I think I actually need a, a nugget in that. I, I might be wrong. But I can't place anything in here. Like, what what am I missing? What am I missing here? There, there used to be a book of, like, a tone book. Let me type this in and see if this pops up. If I have to type this in, like, tone book, maybe? To stone ball. How do you get tone book out of stone ball? Or st stone ball out of tone book. They were completely opposite. So I'm trying to see how... We actually do this. Huh, that's weird. Uh, this gives me nothing, really, if you haven't already done so. So I wonder if I if I take this and place it here? No, because that's just kind of the same thing. Oh, I lost my book. There we go. How do we do this? Please tell me. I've got the four sword, which I know goes in the middle. And then you're supposed to be able to enchant it with just a bunch of random things. I've got to be missing something. I mean, this is kind of put up there... Unless I might need some more stuff, I could try to go get some more of these power ores. Which, uh, I'm trying to think, where would be the best way, uh, best place to actually get the- Are you ki Why are you spawned in here? You see how bright it is? Like, how are you honestly spawning here? Where is he going? Oh wait, there's some more- He, he wanted to show me, I'm so sorry! Overkill! Oh, I just got the overkill achievement in Minecraft. Alright, I'll take that. Oh man. He wanted to just show me. He was a tour guy. He didn't want to be a skeleton no more. Alright, so, let's go ahead and grab this. Hopefully this is enough. I, like, uh, if I had to be straight diagonal right now. Yeah, straight diagonal. I would say, I still don't think this is going to fix it, but we can try. I hate it when just random things fail. Okay. Please tell me that's enough. It, it gosh. Why do I still feel like this is not going to work? So let me throw this here. It, it's not. That says tier one. There's got to be something that I'm missing, like, Force Infuser can be, uh, why does it not tell me what I need to do this? Like, this is what kind of gets me a little bit mad sometimes with mods, is it doesn't explain itself all the way. From what I saw, is the guy was able to put this engine here. Uh, he was able to then go ahead and pump the MJs, or the Michael Jordans, into the Force Infuser, like we have here. I do not believe, I could be wrong when I say this, but I do not believe that we need any more Michael Jordans to at least do one enchantment. I mean, that seems like it might be an overkill. And it's still actually pumping more in. I mean, it's got all this stuff. Can I, like, output it even more? Like, throttle? None. How do I throttle it more? I want overdrive. I want overdrive, please. I'm not sure. Ah, man. I don't know. We might have to save this, honestly. It's kind of disappointing. Huh. So let's go ahead and I'm going to get a few... Uh, things of obsidian here. We're gonna go to the nether. We're gonna try to get some glowstone and I think we might end up wrapping it up I do apologize. Uh, I know I said that we were gonna get this but obviously this is a huge task so hopefully uh, Towards the beginning of the episode or excuse me the next episode uh, We'll be able to fly because right now it's kind of dumb And if we can't and if this just doesn't want to work at all, which I think it might it's probably it's probably changed up a few things here uh then I will try to just get a bat and then we can morph into that. But uh, I, I might go ahead and research this in the in this episode here just to make sure later on. But let's uh let's focus our stuff on some other things. Wait, wait a second. I just had a really good idea. So we're gonna need some feathers. And as we uh, as we're getting feathers or uh, as we're gonna get some more feathers here, why don't we breed some chickens? And I actually went ahead and I put all of the seeds back over here. Oh gosh, it's nighttime. I should probably yeah I'm gonna go sleep. I'm gonna go sleep real quick. <laughs> I'm I'm not gonna put up with that. But I'm probably gonna get some more of these seeds here. Uh, breed the chickens. And then we should be able to... Wait. While you are morphed. What? Oh, I... I what was I morphed into the whole time? I don't think I was morphed into... That sounds so gross. Like some crunching of leaves. There we go. Alright. Nice. Gosh, I'm kind of disappointed though. That, that it just doesn't work like that. Man. That's a... That's a downfall. Alright, uh, I don't need these. Is there anything I can eat here? My gosh, there's so much junk. Let me just throw some more things in here. I wonder if I have any things for lucky blocks. Actually, that could be something. I believe they need some other things than just gold. Uh, let's check that real quick. Lucky blocks. We could actually open up one here if it only needs... Oh, and a dropper! Which is so... Let's do a lucky block! Oh! Oh, yes. Oh, wait, I already had cobble. Uh, do I have redstone? No, but there should be some. I think in this chest right here. It's got to be around here somewhere. There we go. All right, let me throw all the other junk too in here. I still have to smelt down things like, uh, I think the tin is actually for Tinker's Construct. There's different types of tin. I know that there's some for 
uh, things like industrial craft, which I don't know if we have. I always think industrial craft involves the macerators, but I don't think that they do. It might be build craft. Uh, what else do I not need here? Someone's gonna yell at me too for that. Uh, <laughs> you don't know? You don't know what they're for? I'm like, I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, so we'll place those. Is there anything else? Let me let me place this in there too. I don't need all that gunpowder. All right, I know I have a few things that are just a little bit overkill right now, but uh, we should have enough space now. From there, we just need that. How did I not get redstone? How did I honestly not get redstone after going in that chest? So that, the gold, and the redstone. All right, so let's make the dropper first. I can't believe that droppers are so easy to make. I always thought that they were uh, like a combination of, say, uh, like an arrow or something, but I guess it's the dispenser that's that. What am I missing out on here? Oh, it's that with the dropper in the middle. Okay. Uh, there we go. Nice. And a, and a cool fact about the top of the dropper and furnaces look just like that, where it looks almost like regular stone. I used to play in a Minecraft server where it was basically, I forget what it was called. I doubt it's still around. It was like way, way long, uh, a long time ago. But you were able to basically go in and steal people's stuff. And it was, it was legal. It was kind of a free-for-all server. And you would kind of hide all your stuff inside of a furnace when you logged out. And it would almost look like a regular block from above. And it, it was actually really cool. And being able to see that was brought back so many cool memories. Because that server, I put way too much time into that. Alright. I'm kind of scared to open this up next to my house. So I'm going to go a little bit over... Uh... Let's go over to where the village is. I guess we'll kill two birds with one stone here. Let's go off to over where this plane is here. Alright. So we opened up our lucky block. I think it was over there before. So hopefully this thing is good and it doesn't kill... Oh! Ooh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> what? Those are the most OP thing as I imagine if you had that along with um uh, with the helmet. The, all that thing needs is like auto regen, and I would say, all right, force armor. I'd like to fly, but I can morph into a bat. I'll see you next leg. <laughs> like I am so out of here. All right, let's jump down here. What the heck? He's got like a creeper on his head. A troll creep. Now, in order for me to get that, I gotta kill this guy. And he's a friendly, gosh dang it, I, I don't really need the troll creeper that bad. Uh, creepers haven't been my best friend in the past either way. <sighs> Since we weren't around here, it wasn't actually uh, spawning in this chunk, so it didn't oh, it didn't grow any of this stuff. We do have a lot of bone meal, so I'll go back and grab this. It has been back and forth, back and forth so many times. I am really glad that I have the Zans mini map and not the default one that it comes with, because the teleporting is so overused right now. Uh, wait, was it... In there? Where the heck did I just put all this stuff in? There it is. Okay, nice. Uh, teleport back to the town itself. I don't know why I still have the waypoints for the lucky blocks that I found in the wilderness. I should probably go ahead and uh, delete those. A helicopter! I so want that. I so want that. You don't even know. You don't even know how... Oh, man. I can put a bounty out on you. I don't even have to get my hands dirty. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab... Wait, what? That's a cool thing. Or if you just keep bone, you can actually just bone meal the same thing over though. I'm sure this isn't that good for uh, saving bone meal, but if you just had like one spot, that'd be kind of cool. I like that. There's 50 something bone meal wasted for, oh, 25. Wait, that's not bad. But four seeds because you didn't actually get to break them all. Hey, eh. I don't know. It's kind of a trade off. But now I at least have some seeds here. Uh, it's not a lot by any means, but we can get some more later if we need to. Oh, man. So let me see. I said I wanted those for the chickens. We're going to go get obsidian right after this. And uh, then we will get some glowstone. Alright, come here. I want your feathers, so uh, just just keep going at it. Alright. Um, take those. And I can't believe these things here. Wow, those things are so OP. Lucky chest plate and the lucky leggings. No, that's like such a cool word. Lucky leggings. Lucky leggings. I don't know why I always say things randomly like that. Like in that voice, I've never known why I do stuff. Like in that voice sometimes, I, I don't know. I guess everyone's kind of got that uh, that voice that they use. <laughs> Take it overextend or overhype something. Alright. Uh, whew, man, I'm not going to lie. My throat is on fire right now. I'm going to push on here. We might actually save the nether for next episode. I think that's what I'm going to decide on doing. So, oh, wow. Let me get you. Oh, now I can be a red one. Oh, no, I'm going to drown. I'm going to drown in it, though. Get away. You wouldn't hurt your own kind, would you? I guess he would. I guess he would. What did he just drop? He dropped, like, a like a red tear or something. Oh, it showed up on the right side, too, and I didn't see it. Gosh dang it. 
Alright, so I believe the least amount that you need for a nether portal is 10 obsidian. So, hopefully... Actually, the best way for me to get this, really, is just to go ahead and grab the mining turtle. That thing goes off. It, it doesn't care about obsidian. Like, honestly, it will go off and grab obsidian as fast as it grabs uh, regular stone. Let me go ahead and do that. Where did I place that at? I think it's... I think it's back at the... Uh, chicken pen over here. Yeah, I let it mine out the other way over here. It feels so weird to be one block tall. Oh my gosh, this is so cool though. Let me like go associate like Hey guys, uh, I'm not your height. Uh, this doesn't change anything. I'm still your ruler. Don't don't you don't you think otherwise? Oh, yes, there's some more power ore here, too. I'll take that. I got the power. I don't know why I haven't said that yet. Jeez, perfect punchline. Alright, uh, anything else that I'm missing out on? I don't really need that gold, even though we just used it to make the lucky blocks. So now with this, you'll see how OP this is. I need some coal, though. I think I actually left some back there. I can grab this right here. Alright, uh, do that. That should be enough. What did I just- Oh no, I threw out my, my pickaxe! There we go. So this thing will just tear through it easily. What I honestly don't know is why I haven't set a waypoint all the way at the end of this thing. Like, wouldn't you think that would be something smart? <sighs> Sometimes I just forget. Oh, 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 come on, come on. How do we, like, how do us slimes, I want to see this, I want to see this bat. What the heck do I have on my head right now? I want to see how us slimes, like, fight. Do we headbutt each other? Like, it just, we just kind of stare at each other. We got laser beam eyes. Ho! Oh, that was like Star Wars. Now I'm going to turn into the green one. Look at that. <laughs> oh, man, that's kind of annoying that they auto-change, though. I wish you didn't uh, change every single time you killed them. So, tunnel probably... What, five? Like, honestly, we just need this stuff here. Yeah, that should be enough there. That honestly might be the rest that we need. Oh, no, but hold on. Oh, wait, wait, no, no, it does grab it. Okay, I was about to say, it's probably dropping, but no, it should be good. Like, look at that. That is so easy. Easy mode right there. That's how we do it with mods. That is so... <laughs> oh, man, you see those vanilla Minecrafters in there? They're sitting there trying to get their diamond pickaxes in there. They're kind of sweating over it and everything. We're just sitting there. We're like, Mighty Turtle, do that. Why? Because technology. All right. Let's grab this here. And we should be good to go now. We actually have the 14, so we can actually... Oh, no, I'm one off. Uh, I don't really need the edges there. Now, where do I want to put this? That is the other question. I don't want it to be right in my main headquarters because it's loud. Uh, let, me, let me just change back to this thing right here because I'm getting annoyed by being one block tall. Uh... So we'll change back into that. As a bat, too, you're also one block tall. But then you could also fly, so it's like a trade-off. Uh, why can't I run now? I kind of like being the slime now. The slime feels a little bit faster, even though he was probably the same exact speed as me. He was just smaller. Alright. Maybe I'll just place it right here. Uh, hmm. I think that might be what I have to do. I have to do this to save my country. But, uh, yeah. Maybe I'll make a room for all the portals. Uh, so we walk in here. I'm trying to see how I could do this. We walk in here and maybe he the problem is some portals are only two or I guess four wide and then some are three wide, so it's not gonna be exactly symmetrical. So I'm trying to think how exactly I would like to do this to where it wouldn't look like uh, a load of garbage. This right here will be probably where the nether portal goes because we're gonna need four there. But then also we have whatever that mod is that brings us to a paradise world. It's not the either. Whatever it is, uh, I'll have to research that uh, whenever we get to it. I, I want to get four stuff or I guess dark craft out of the way first and actually learn some of this. And then we'll head on to other mods. But for right now, we'll probably do Tinker's Construct after this. I, I love Tinker's. That's my favorite mod of all time. Like I have a lot of uh, mods that I enjoy, but Tinker's is just like on another level. Now, why did I just do this like... Four, I don't know. Either way, I have enough to do it. Uh, that's four. So it should only have to go right there. Nice. And then we'll we'll set that on fire in a second. But like I was saying, I think that uh that will be this here. But then something like the end portal that is three wide. Huh. We'll figure out something. Uh, maybe it won't look that bad. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'll have to see how it will look later on. And I'll put a door on here too. But. But right now, we have been going for over an hour and a half. Excuse me. So, um, I don't uh, I don't feel like going for much longer here. My throat is killing me. I wish I could just go for like 12 hours. But then that would also take like 100 hours to upload or something. Like, ugh. 
Either way, uh, now we just need some iron. So I'm going to go ahead and throw that there. Some iron and some flint. Which I don't think I have any. Maybe I have like a straggler. Please tell me I throw flint out some. Nice! Wow, I had a few things of flint. Wow. Alright, uh, we only need one. There we go. Watch them like change this on me or something. I think it's like that. Nice. Alright, that's another thing that I always get mixed up. I always put either the iron here rather than there, and it just... Oh, why can't everything just be a shapeless crafting recipe? Except things like crafting, uh, say like a pickaxe or something. But besides that, everything should be like a shapeless crafting. Alright. Oh, there we go. So, I think this is where we are going to leave it for next episode. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the long episode here. Like I stated earlier, let me know if you guys want to see either daily episodes that are a little bit shorter. So maybe anywhere from uh, 15 to 20 minutes. Or if you want to see long episodes like this that maybe aren't daily, but uh, maybe you don't watch in one sitting and you come back and just watch the rest of that. If you guys don't know, maybe, I don't know how much you guys have watched of YouTube. If you watch a long video and you come back, it'll actually just save the timestamp. I believe it will... If you watched on computer, I don't know if it's on mobile. I believe on mobile it doesn't work like that. But either way, uh, I think we are going to go ahead and end it here. It has been, even though we couldn't get the flag down here, it's still been a pretty productive uh, episode. I know some things were done a little bit in a hurry here, so we will have to go back and retouch up some things like a chicken farm that uh, that definitely needs some work. And uh, we'll, we'll also have to go over there and get some things set up because I think that's going to be where we keep all the animals. So to say things like cows once we get those in. But uh, for right now, it does the job. I'm trying to think what else did we do. We just looted the heck out of that thing, the, uh, the building over there. And we also died. We still haven't gotten all the way to that. So maybe we'll do some of that in a future episode and try and do that. If we feel crazy enough, we got the grass growing all the way down here. Uh, thanks to one of you guys, uh, it actually is all the way done, rather than waiting and, uh, for all of it to spread all the way down here, so that is awesome that it is now completely finished here, and look at that grass, you can't, you can't deny that, that neon green grass and the, the, the pixels are so, so low res, but either way, thank you so much for watching guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the Mad Pack, thank you so much for watching, and have a good day, bye!